Okay, you guys, so welcome to this vlog. Um, I'm kind of angry right now, so I'm gonna stand right here because there's some good lighting. But I'm very angry right now. I went to work and my cats decided they wanted to ruin my freaking Christmas tree. Can we just get a glimpse of this? I seriously hate my cats. Like, really? And then I tried, like, putting it back on. And, like, I don't know, there's like, there's, oh, there it goes. It popped off right there, so. No Christmas tree this year. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Malibu. So today, for this vlog, I'm going to be making, where is it? It was right there. I'm going to be making this French onion soup. Okay, so this is what we're going to be making. We're going to be making a baked burgundy French onion soup. And all you gotta do is a large, thinly sliced onion. I've never cut up an onion before, so this is going to be a trial experiment. I'm gonna probably YouTube it. So, we got our handy dandy knife. <laughs> We're gonna start with a pan and then we are going to be adding seven cups of water to it. All right, so now we're adding the seventh cup in. And then next on the directions, it says whisk contents of this package. Whisk contents of this package into seven cups of water, and then add one large thinly sliced onion. Heat on a medium heat until it becomes to a slow boil. So, alright. So, I'm just gonna tear this open. Nice. That's what it looks like. It looks so good. So tasty. And we're going to take our fancy cheap, I don't know where we got, where I got this from, but I have a whisk. So we're just going to start whisking this, the soup in. Alright, so we're whisking in. So that we have whisked that and we have the we have our oven on a number seven. Alright, so now that you have your onions all good, you're just going to pour them in. Ooh, splattered a little bit. Get all those onions in there. And then you're just gonna whisk this together. And then we gotta bring this to a nice slow boil. So sometimes this burner doesn't work. Oh, yep, yeah, but it's working today. All right. Now we're just gonna wait till this is ready. Ooh, and also I got a new wine. Look at how cute this is. So this is from Italy, but look it, it's called Sheep Thrills. I love Sheep Thrills. It's a little bit in between a drier and a sweeter mix, but look at how cute this is. Cheer! Isn't that just the cutest? Ooh, yes, ma'am. Ooh, that. Below. Yeah, but it's a little bit in between a dry and a uh, sweet, but it's a little bit more drier than my liking. I just want to show you guys what I got for Black Friday. As you can tell, I had gotten a new screen TV. Big 55 inch for my living room. That was a little, my big purchase of the year. Or of Black Friday. I also picked up Finding Dory. This is only $10, and normally it's like $30. These were, I think, three dollars a piece they're originally ten but they're these cute little soup containers a little thing I thought they'd be cool for work Ooh, what is this steam vent with freshness date oh that's fancy it has like the little freshness date so you can like pick what day you made it oh it's so cute and it just pops open like this and then so cute it's like a little ceramic Christmas bowl and Super cute. 
I got two. One to gift and one to keep. I don't know which one to keep. So, what else did I get? Ooh, I got some new hand towels, some new bath towels. I got the really expensive kind, because they were originally $30 a piece for a bath towel, but I got them on sale for, um, what was it? Seven, seven eighty something, and I was like, "Holy cow, that's a really good deal." Why is my soup not heated up yet? It's not boiled yet. Okay, but anyway, yeah, I went to Her Burgers, I went to Target, I got, I also got this thing. Oh, all right, this thing. I'm gonna unplug this, but this is what I got. It's by Sharper Image. It was twenty dollars, and it's a six-port USB plug-in for all my gadgets and stuff. When really, I only have like. Three. But, and then I also ordered an iPad. That should be coming tomorrow, I believe. But yeah, I had a really good Thanksgiving. Nothing much. I uh, hung out with the family and everything. I'm thinking about making makeup videos because everybody says I did my uh, friend's makeup and she just said I did a really good job. But I hate how on my eyes there are these little overgapping laps. Do you see that? Like, look at right there. You see that? Oh, gross. Like you see that excess skin right there? Like what the hell? So I don't know. All right, so once your soup comes to a slow boil, which this is a heavy boil, but we're going to reduce it to a low medium heat. So we're going to do five. And we're going to let that simmer for 20 minutes. Hey Siri, set a timer for 20 minutes. Okay, 20 minutes and counting. 24 days until I get my new phone, woohoo. So, totally forgot that the directions on the thing have a stern suggestion and it says splash of red wine. So, let's get this motherfucking splash in here. I'm going to, uh, look at this cute ass sheep on the front too. Look at how cute that is. I spilled the wine. Is that a splash? Got the red wine in there. Ooh, smells good. We've got about eight minutes left on this. All right, guys, so this is the finished product. I just put some Gouda cheese in it to make it a little bit more delicious. Mm, doesn't that look good? Yes, queen. All right, so we are now going to try the French onion soup I made. Okay, so y'all can see my crooked uh, Christmas tree in the background, but the soup was amazing. I'm just adding this um, little comment about the soup because I guess it stopped recording after that. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. Vlogmas Day 1 is officially done. I'm so excited. If you guys did like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and, a and also subscribe if you want. Alright guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.